Hey, welcome everyone. Brendan back with another video. Today we're looking at the new filtering. We have query, sort, filter, and live search uh, added to Bricks in 1.9.6. Now keep in mind this is an experimental feature. So uh, we probably don't use it on production sites. I'm going to go ahead and just do it on this small site that I have that I made for my dad. And I don't really care if it breaks. I don't think it's going to. It's a very, very simple search feature that we're going to add. So let's just, uh, let's do it. So I've, I've now enabled that query filter. Um, I don't know if I need to hit this. Let's just do that. Uh, okay. And we have some ACF posts just with plays and there's some play categories. There's four categories. You can see there's some plays in there. So, what I'm going to do is let's go to the site and I'm going to click all the plays here. Right now, this is how I have it filtered. Right now, you can click in here to go to the comedies. That lists all the comedies. Um, but what I want to do is add maybe the filtering to this page. So how do I, how am I going to do this? I think, I think I can grab this query here because that should be showing all plays, but it's conditionally showing for the category. So let me just, let me grab this. Hopefully this will work. I'm gonna edit this page as well. And I wanna grab this grid here, this whole container. Grid three, grab that. And let's open this guy up. And this will be, our main section up here. So what do I want to do? I want to uh, paste that in there. I think we have a container and then I want like another block, I think. And then this will be like our filter block. Yes. And then let's do grid on this con outer container. Um, I don't know what, like one, three. Two, three, one, three, something like that. Let's also make this can this grid just a grid two. Filter block. Let's put a uh what's this? This is gonna be filter results, I guess. Filter results. And then there should be some new I type in filter here. Filter with the filter. Uh filter checkbox. I don't know which one I want. Filter, I think filter radio. That's the little buttons. And then let's put a filter, let's put a search filter in here. Let's move that up. And let's gap this out. Okay. So we have our filter search here, target query, all query. So let me look really quick here. This block is just called block. This is gonna be all plays. And I think we also have another one called all plays. That one's called query. So if I go to the search, query, yeah, so I just want all plays. Apply on input, sure. Placeholder search. Yeah, I mean that looks that looks fine. It's pretty pretty light typography, but that's okay. And then for the radio buttons, let's again select that all plays, apply on input. Um, action filter. Yes, we want it to filter. We want it to do a taxonomy. Let's do the play categories from ACF. Okay, good. So they're showing up. And I count. Okay. What if I do this? Oh, uh, okay. That looks like it hopefully saved and then reloaded, I guess. Okay. It's showing, it's showing the count now there. So that's perfect. And then what do we want? Uh, mode radio, but I think I think that that's what they had in the video. Button sized, okay, that's just sizes. Style, okay, those are just the default bricks ones. Okay, well, I guess we can use. Oh, we don't have to. We can use our own background color. Let's just use the dark ones though. And then I don't know on active. Let's just do a slightly darker color, I guess. I don't know. 
Yeah, so that looks that's looks like it's working. I don't know. Let's see what on the front end. And then since this is a live website, I'm I'm kind of well, I'm breaking all the rules here. I'm doing ID styling on my query, but I'm also doing this on a live site. So uh do as I say, don't as I not as I do, I suppose. Um we could do that, and then on this one we could just do grid one one. Okay. All right, well, that looks like it's working. Make this a little bigger. And let's go to the front end. Okay, this should only show four. Perfect. Yeah, looks like, looks like it works. That's perfect, because I just, I didn't want to put grid builder. I mean, this is such a simple filter that, um, you know, I'm not doing much other than just categories right here. So anyway, good good little use test. Um, I would say probably don't do this on production sites still though, and especially if it's like a large e-commerce site or big database. I'm not going to do that on any large sites. Uh, just this one for my dad. So hopefully it doesn't break. Um, what's the? Oh, I could also I guess maybe add pagination in here. I think. Um. I don't know, do I need to add it as a block? Imagination, query, all plays. Yeah, okay. I bet, isn't there like some kind of little Ajax thing on here? Wait, wait. Uh, enable Ajax down here. Navigate through different queries without re reloading the page. That might be what I need. Let's try that. Oh, look, there we go. That's that's what you need to make sure you have that checked. So that goes through all the pages. All right, let me make sure this doesn't look uh, terrible. Uh, okay, well, it's all right. That's all right. That's okay. All right, well, there we go. So I've got my filtering. That seems to work. Now the, the search. Let's see if I type in Henry. And that doesn't seem to work. Okay, so what do I need to do there? Uh, oops. Oh, winter, that works. Love. No. Oh, I need to, I think I needed to reset the categories. So if I typed in Henry here, okay, so it's showing those are grayed out and that's the one that's part of, and then it shows the results, so. Winter sale should be part of okay perfect and love love ladies okay perfect so that that works all right i think that's all i wanted to do and good luck hopefully you guys come up with some really interesting queries I, i'm excited to see all the different filters available so um don't need to install another plugin for simple stuff like this i i don't know i mean obviously this is just released today so we'll have to see how it compares to something like wp grid builder but Super powerful, um, very useful stuff. So I appreciate it. And yeah, have a good weekend, everyone. Bye.